my night wolves and welcome back to another video on my channel and today we're here with the zodiac challenge with our gemini also known as gwen yeah gwen uh she has a sister named grace and her name is gwen but in the last video if you didn't see the last video go check it out but in the last video she uh cheated on her boyfriend she went on a date with skylar for love day and he showed up at the date and caught her cheating now she's not even sad that he divorced her she's just pissed so I was like oh when I get in she's most likely gonna be sad and I'll just deal with it and we'll go through the motions nope I just get in and she's just pissed <laughs> like girl you have no right to be pissed for one because he caught you cheating so he has every right to be pissed off at you. Um, you have no reason to be pissed. Okay? Okay. We have to throw a lot of parties. And I am having a hard time with this. We're like really close to the end of Gemini. So we're on Generation 5 Gemini. Uh, she must have a twin, which she does. You are the opposite of your twin, which she is. Reach level 10 of the Christmas skill, which she is really close to. She is like 9 or 8. Christmas. She's level 8, almost level 9. So she's almost done with that. Must move into the TLC apartment, which we are. We are which we're living in right now. Throw so every type of party at least once. Okay. So this is where I'm like, they added, since they did this, they've added so many parties so many parties we got baby shark keg party toddler play date birthday party uh ranch animal day ranch gathering black and white bash slumber party neighborhood potluck uh like so freaking many parties and i know this is from like a long time ago because this is um this was, uh, somebody made this like a while ago. So I was thinking, since there are so many, I'm not going to do certain ones. So here are the ones that I'm going to be doing and then the ones that I'm not going to be doing. So baby shower, we'll do. Keg party, I'm, I'm not gonna do because, or we could actually still do it. But I, I, I feel like that's more like a university thing. So I don't have a reason to throw a keg party. So we're not going to do the keg party. But we'll do the baby shower. We'll do the toddler play date when we have a toddler. Birthday party, we're going to do. Ranch animal day, we're not going to do. Ranch gathering, we're not going to do. Summer party, we'll do. Smoky party, we're not going to do. Co this costume party, I don't think we're going to do. Pool party, we're not going to do because we don't have a pool. Family reunion, we will do. Dinner party, we will do. Dance party, we will do. Arini roast, we're not gonna do. Cava party, we're not gonna do. So we have still a lot to do, but I slimmed it down to a few. The dance party is not really like anything, so we're not gonna do that. I think I don't know if I said that or not. I know it says to throw every party at least once, but yeah, that's a lot. So, I have been throwing at least one party each episode, but I think I'm gonna have to do at least two party parties. So, I think we're gonna have a dinner party. Alright, we're gonna do the dinner party on Sunday. Our girl is gonna have her birthday on Wednesday, so we're gonna not be a young adult, we're going into being adult. So, we're having a dinner party. Sunday then we're gonna have her birthday party on Wednesday because it's her birthday So our girl's mad. Let's go and have her cool down Let's have you take an angry poop Take a cold shower. Okay, the cat is sick. We gotta take the cat to the vet uh, And uh, we're gonna clean up this random plate on the ground. Oh, yeah, do we have a job? Okay, we don't have a job. So let's get a job. I'm gonna do the walk-in closet. So that is tomorrow. So we'll have that to do tomorrow and then Sunday will be the party. So we won't have to, so we won't be able to do a job. Here we are at the vets. 
Okay, we got Hunter seen by the vet. I did get wellness treat just in case he decides to get sick again and we don't have to come here. So let's head home. Oh, ooh, the spice festival is going on. Yes. Yeah, we had to learn all the foods from the stalls still. Okay, we know we discovered 15 of 27. I discovered 16 of 27 of the recipes. Yay. A girl did the spice thing and she won and she uh, won $100. So I won $100 and I got a t-shirt for uh, completing the spice curry challenge. Ooh, we got a cow plant. What? I came over here to uh, gather some stuff because why not? And a girl got a cow plant randomly. We can't plant a cow plant where we live, so I'm just gonna sell it. I just did that so we can get extra cash. I'm just having my girl eat a whole bunch of food. So we can learn all the stuff. 17 of 27, nice. I just have her like eat a whole bunch of food because I'm like, I just want her to know all the recipes already. Cause why not? The festival will end in one hour. Okay, so this will be the last thing we'll probably get then. And that's fine. At least we got 17 out of 27. That's really close to finishing. Okay, here we are at our job and there's a servo here. Does a servo live here? Is that all who lives here? Is a servo? I don't see any like actual sims, just a servo. Go ahead and come and go to the bathroom. Okay, so we have two bathrooms upstairs. We have three, four bedrooms. And we have a bathroom downstairs. Maybe I'll turn this one into the walk-in closet. But if we're talking about walk-in closet, shouldn't it be an actual walk-in closet? So shouldn't it be like a one of the bathrooms? Okay, we're calling the client back to the lot. Of course, the closet was super small, so I couldn't really fit much into it. But they liked cute things and they liked working out. And they didn't say anything about a color, so... Ta-da! Okay. He's ready to talk. Alrighty, how do you like it? Hmm? She didn't- he didn't like it? What? Oh, I got a promotion. Nice. I guess he did a good job. It's just not my taste. Technically, all the boxes were checked. Seriously. Whatever. I got paid. Doesn't matter. Let's go home. Bye. She's feeling confident, so I'm having her do her speech. So it should be level... It should be level 9. Hot tip, there's some great performers playing at the flea market this week. You up for a visit? I actually was gonna invite him to go to the flea market, but he beat me to it. So yeah, let's go. Okay, I was so confused. I said that we had a bad reputation, but our reputation is good. Okay, well, whatever. Anyways, the flea market's going on, so our boy wants us to go to the flea market with him. Gotta watch Performer. We're not even boyfriend and girlfriend with him yet, so we're gonna ask him out. Ooh, our girl learned 19 of 27. She's so close. Yay, we're dating! A girl reached level 9 in Charisma. Nice. Also, it is almost the dinner party time, so we need to end this. So we, we can go home. Because it is almost time for our, like, dinner. I think it's a dinner party? Dinner party time. I thought I made it an event. Did I not make it an event? I thought I did. Okay. I thought I made the thing an event. It, I didn't, so I had to end it and restart it. So now the party should be going. 
Okay, the dinner party went great. I'm gonna end it. Eat your salad and go. Okay. Right. I'm gonna disband group and I'm gonna ask Skylar to move in with us, so more choices. Ask to join household. So, uh, Skylar has moved in to the place with us, so there's that. Okay, we're cleaning up from our dinner party and then we're gonna go to bed. Oh yeah, uh, does our guy have a, uh, Skylar doesn't have a career, so let's get him one when he wakes up. Okay, our girl's awake, gonna get food. Okay, so what should Skylar be? I feel like Skylar would be like a teacher. So education. So he is in education. Okay, here we are at our job. And I love how our girl is non-committal and she cheated on someone. She cheated on her ex. And now she has a fear of being cheated on. She's non-committal. And she's afraid of being cheated on like she did to her ex. Okay, girl. <laughs> So we're here to uh, renovate a room. Oh my gosh. There is one, two, three, four, five Sims living in this house of two bedrooms with two bedrooms. I sent the clients away. She's still here. Okay, I'm thinking about changing this room up and maybe adding obviously more beds because like there's so many sims in this house and they need um, more beds. It's gonna do bunk beds. Okay, we're gonna reveal it to them. There's six sims in the house and I only put five beds. Oh well, someone's not gonna be able to sleep. I tried. Why is there so many people in this one house with two bedrooms? <clears throat> Anyways, here's the bedroom. I tried my best. Not everyone's gonna like it and that's fine. So this guy came over to me and hugged me. Okay, everyone is ready to talk. So my girl really had to pee, so she's doing that. And then we're gonna ask everyone for their final thing. A lot of them did not like some, I don't know. A lot of them didn't like what I had done to the room, which whatever. This guy is stomping his feet. He's so pissed off about it. Oh, this guy liked it. He didn't like it like I thought so because he was like stomping his feet. And this guy liked it. Nice. Yeah, she didn't like it. Yeah, there's, a, there's only two that seem to like it. Maybe this guy likes it. Yeah, so a lot of them didn't like it. But only two liked it. Can't win them all. It's fine. They didn't pay me. They did not pay me for what I did. I think at least they should pay a little bit of money for my, for working on the freaking room. Well, I've been having her work out more because she's been eating a lot more. We're not even making a sound. He's working on his job because he got a thing where it's like, create a lesson plan. He's creating a lesson plan. My girl here is running on the treadmill Everyone is silent. We're not making a sound. And this biatch comes over and he's like, Hey, never can you kindly keep the noise down? I can hear you through the drywall. Please be considerate. Other people live here too. Dude, we're not even making a sound. Okay, so we're at a job. There's so many people in this household. We have an infant, an infant, and... A toddler, a teenager, teen, two teens, and the parents. So, nice. So this is a 
preference room renovation. So that's fun. There is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight people in this house with one bedroom, one bathroom. <sighs> well then. So I decided to do the living room. So that's what we're gonna do. Yeah, okay, calling the clients back. They should uh, had it where you add rooms because they need a lot of rooms for these people. Anyways, yes, I'm ready. Let's uh, reveal it to them. Okay, so I gave them places to put their toddlers at least. So yeah, the teenagers can sleep out on the couch and the parents can sleep in their bedroom and then the toddlers can sleep here. Yeah, there's still not enough room, but at least we got some room for the kids. Okay, it looks like everyone likes it, which is awesome. Okay, everyone seems to really like it. So let's talk to everybody. Yeah, he loved it. So mostly everyone in this house loves it. Which is great. Nice. Oh my god, this mom is out here. One baby crawled to... Yeah, the, one baby's crawling all the way over here. This one's over here napping in the road. And she's like running back and forth trying to figure out what one to go to. Not for, like... Girl. Maybe stop having children. Okay, everybody loved the new thing. Nice. Wait, you're telling me it went really well and I got Jack Daily Squat for it? Ooh, our sister called and is like, we're thinking about trying for a baby. Try for that baby. You have three kids, but sure, go ahead and try again. Go ahead and try to uh, get it. Yeah, so she, has, she had triplets. And she's like, I want more kids. Sure. Also, uh, our guy here did get a promotion, so congratulations on your promotion. For some reason, I can't sleep. It says it's too noisy for going to sleep right now. Is it broken? Like, he's sleeping, why can't I sleep? Okay, it's her birthday party. Oh yeah, today is our twin's birthday. It's Grace's birthday as well. Because we're twins. Okay, I had the sister age up. Grace aged up. And now we're gonna blow out the candles and age up ourselves now. Uh, blow out candles. Blowing out the candles. There we go. Everyone come and take a piece together. We had a birthday party. I think we're gonna try for a baby with Skylar now. I was gonna wait until they got married, but a girl is already an, an adult. It's time for us to move on with the baby making. And we know that she's gonna marry him, so. Oh, the cat's aging up. The cat's aging up as well. Hunter's aging up. And we're eating for two. Wow, a lot of stuff is happening. We had a birthday, we had another birthday, we had another birthday, we had three birthdays. We had the twins' birthday, Gwen and Grace's birthday, and then when Hunter just celebrated his birthday. And now I'm eating for two. Oh, that means Hunter's old. He's gonna die. Guess what? I'm pregnant. Yay! We're pregnant. Yeah. Um, must have a twin. She does. Um, you are the opposite of your twin. Reach level ten of the Christmas skill, which she's almost there. Throw parties, which we are. Have three jobs, which you did. Travel to at least two community lots each week, which we have been doing. Have at least level four and three different skills, which we got. Learn all the recipes from the vendors, which we're almost there. Have one set of twins. So we're gonna have one set of twins. Be caught cheating by your spouse, which you did. So yeah, we're gonna have to have one set of twins. So, 
since we're gonna have to have twins, let's put on the thing where da, 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 there on landline so now she's gonna have twins but yeah i'm gonna leave this video here i hope you guys enjoyed it if you guys did make sure you give this video a thumbs up ring that bell if you want to see more videos from me subscribe if you want to and i'll see you beautiful night wolves in the next video goodbye Don't you know that you're